Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. You don't know, it's your girl Shooks, the queen of recipe. Here today guys to share with you my chicken and shrimp chop suey. As you can see guys, I already prepped my um, ingredients. So here I have pak choy and bean sprout. I separated the white part of the pak choy from the green part because the green part tends to cook easier and this is why I separated all of my vegetables according to how I believe that they would cook okay so I have my shrimp green onions carrot mushroom and green beans I have my bell peppers I have red orange yellow green and that's the white part of our pak choy and I have my purple onion you can use yellow onion okay here I have my already grilled chicken breast. You can use fresh chicken breast, you just wanna make sure that you cut them nicely, thin as possible, and you would cook the chicken breast when you are cooking your shrimp, okay? So what I'm gonna do now, I'm just gonna add my wok to the stove, and I'm just gonna add some olive oil, and we're gonna get right into it. Okay, so here I added the olive oil to my wok and I'm just going to let this um, heat up a little bit and then I'm going to add my shrimp. So now we're going to add our shrimp. Now we're just going to leave it here to cook on one side and now we're going to flip them over, okay? Okay, so we're just going to turn these. See, they're looking nice and all, guys. So what we're going to do, we're going to remove these and then we're going to put in our vegetable, okay? Some of our vegetables. So we're just going to turn these over and then we are going to remove them. So I'm just giving them like probably just one more minute and then I'll remove these and add some of our vegetables. So I removed the shrimp. So now I am going to add my carrots, my beans, and my mushrooms. Just gonna stir this up and give this like three minutes and then we're gonna add another batch of our vegetables. Everything is looking lovely already guys, see that? Yes. Okay, so now we are going to add our sweet pepper, our bell peppers, our onion and our the white part of our um pak choy just gonna spin this up combine everything together wow Look how beautiful this is looking already, guys. Honestly, it smells so good already. Okay. So what I did, guys, I covered down the pot. Um, so this get a nice cook on it. So I'm just giving this like two minutes with the cover on. And then I'm going to add the rest of our vegetables. So now we are going to add the bean sprout and the green part of our bok choy. Give this a little bit of skin. And then we're just going to cover this down again for about one minute or two. Okay guys. So now I'm going to add about a tablespoon of my chopped garlic and I'm just going to add about a tablespoon of fish sauce. We can use oyster sauce as well. 
about about half tablespoon of my fish sauce and we're going to be using as well some soy sauce and about two tablespoons of soy sauce yes now we're going to give this a nice little stir and then we're going to add our chicken and our shrimp okay lovely so we added our chicken and our, and our shrimp now we're going to add some cayenne pepper and you can add this according to your liking okay you can add this according to your liking and some black pepper You can taste and if you need salt, you can add some salt, okay? Now we're just gonna combine all of this together. And we have one last thing to add, our green onion. But let's combine this first. Okay guys, and of course we have to top up our pot with some fresh bell peppers and our green onions. I love to do this, it just, the color and the flavor just gets better when we do this and basically guys we're just gonna mix this up together and this is our grand finale this is our final final result it is looking absolutely amazing guys look at that yes let me know what you think about this recipe guys. If you're liking this recipe, please hit that thumbs up button. If you're new to my channel, please hit that subscription button. Subscribe, subscribe for great and amazing content guys. Hit that subscription button. Turn on your post notification bell so you don't miss any of my uploads. Until next time, stay safe.